Welcome to Marshall TV channel. Today's episode is very much different than what we usually showcase. This episode is all about the latest new military technology used in Africa by soldiers for war. Most of the information that will be released is based on journalism facts that were conducted in Africa on national protection authorities. Africa is known to be the richest natural continent in the world that has enough minerals that can help the whole world for the next 45 billion years coming. Without Africa there would never have gold, diamonds, sliver, platinum and other minerals. Well, Africa has to also protect their nature from being taken away from colonists. At number 10 we have the most dangerous truck that has missile at the back of the trailer. The type of truck is called the transporter erector launcher. The truck is an integrated prime mover that can carry heavy large missiles. This warhead missile vehicle can carry up to 8 tons of TNT, RDX and HMX. Those rocket missile can damage a whole large cities like New York City and Tokyo City of its size. The steel that was used to make this trucks weigh 80 tons and eats a lot of fuel, and it's a bulletproof truck. This type of truck is used for strike far distance enemies, with an accurate termination. Well, the price is not cheap at all the price is $5.1 million per truck with missiles. This truck is found in South Africa, Nigeria and Egypt only in Africa. Nine. We have one of the most powerful and dangerous aircraft. The name of the Skyhawk is called Subjas 39 Gripen. This type of jet is only found in South Africa and Egypt within Africa. Egypt stands as the strongest and most powerful country in Africa. They have the latest military technology in Africa. This is one of the fastest light and strong aircraft. It can carry air-to-air missiles such as AIM-9 Sidewinder, air-to-ground missiles which is the AGM-65 Maverick. The total rocket bombs it can carry is 9. Plus this aircraft weighs 6,622 kilograms of its weight. The Saab JAS-39 Gripen has the coolest technology of controlling other bombs and nuclear shoots from the ground, and misleading them away from it. The Gripen 39 can only be operated by one person. It can also do a maximum of 2.130 km per hour. Well, do you know that it can fly up to 50,000 feet which is 15,240 meters high. This aircraft was made in year 1996 and has any engine type turbofan. I know many of you want to find out how much it cost. Well, the price starts from $40 million to $60 million depending on the adjusted performance. Moving on at number 8. We have the military self-fly drone that is used to fly one soldier to their enemy's territory silently without being seen or spotted at night. This type of drone is called Jest and One Passenger Drone. I know it's a weird name to be used for it. Well, this drone doesn't do much except transporting a single soldier to the next attraction point and freezing other military computer satellite connections. This type of drone is found in Egyptian military only in Africa. It was made in year 2019 August when it was produced. Plus it can fly for a maximum of 2 hours on air, which is not bad for a single person drone. The top speed is 200 km per hour. That speed is more than enough for such a small tiny drone for one person. Well, the price of it is $190,000 each drone. Currently Egypt has over 100 of them at the moment. This aircraft weighs 400 kg and made of aluminium. At number 7. We got the coolest technology that most of us never knew Africa has one which is the jetpack. The name of the jetpack is called the Pentagon. It used for fetching soldiers that are lost and it's used to fly into the enemy's territory. Not much is need for a jetpack except escaping from the enemy's tribe, in crucial and critical situations. This jetpack is used in Egypt only in Africa. For my personal opinion the jetpack is just a waste of money and time because drones can be used for the same purpose at a cheaper cost. Do you really think jetpack should be used in military army? Make sure you comment your thoughts. Moving on. This jetpack can do 134 km per hour and has a flight time of 9 minutes. Well, the price is $400,000 each jetpack depending on the performance and flight time. It can fly 1,500 feet high up the sky. At number 6. We got the interesting technology which is a dog, but not just a simple one that people have as a pet at home. This type of military dog is called Sergeant or Messenger. This dog is one of the best in the world at the moment it can smell and sense from far away distance that we as human can't do or robots. Plus it has excellent tracking skills of finding lost people and locating crime evidence as well. The dog has a good biting grab techniques and the dog can put you down one time and finish you up like nothing. Military and police use this dogs for their mission purposes. South African National Defense Force decided to implement the use of bulletproof, 
Many of the dogs were previously shot and killed because there was no protective equipment. They also invented what we call dog goggles and flashlights, for dogs to see at night and to be protective of it from gas smoke including sand dust so that they can see clearly and properly. This materials helps the dog to able to fulfill its duty successfully. Well, the bulletproof price is $15,000. The dog goggles price and flashlight all together is $7,000. Personally I believe that South Africa nailed that perfectly. This invention will help the dogs a lot in getting the job done. At number 5. We have the second most powerful gun in Africa which is called the R5. Well, it's known to be a foldable gun, that can be adjusted. This type of gun is a bit heavy and it weighs 3.7 kilograms. Plus it's hard to make an accurate or straight shots. So the South African government together with the Russian government have decided to invent electronic bullets that will have a direct bullet shots. Cyril Ramaphosa and Vladimir Putin made a deal or agreement about this bullet because they believe that soldiers should not waste bullets. For my own opinion this is one of the coolest technology soon to be implemented in Africa, that will actually make South Africa once again the strongest military country in the continent. This bullet will help all soldiers to shoot directly on their enemies or targets. The bullet shot will go to the targeted person anywhere he or she moves. But, this bullets are not yet being introduced to the military, as they still being tested in Ladysmith KwaZulu Natal province in South Africa within African continent. Well. I know many people we want to ask how powerful is this coming up bullet. For your information the bullets are not being published for details to any journalism as yet. But, if you want to find out more about the bullet just quickly subscribe and comment down below so I will try all be means to get the correct facts about the bullets information. At number 4. We got the the drone catcher which is used to stop and grab all flying drones. Many military armies had problems of enemies spying on them using special drones to gather classified information intel. So Egypt military and Nigerian military decided to invent the drone catcher and it's pretty much useful, than expected. Enemies use drones to hack and record information other military databases. So this drone catcher helps soldiers to stop the drone down and get hold of the tracking system of who is spying on them. Well, the price of it is for $1,600 each drone catcher machine. This type of technology is found only in Nigeria and Egypt. At number 3. We have another coolest technology that Africa has. This military watch can be used to track the movement of all individual soldiers during the battlefield. This watch is used to help the soldiers to find accurate directions on the compass, GPS and mapping. Plus this watches can also read your heart rate. Besides watching the time, the watch can also help with lighting as well. Many military soldiers use this types of watches to send messages to the satellite database. Do you know that this type of watch can make calls and recordings? For my own opinion this is a useful watch especially when you lost or you're in need of assistance support. Well, all military technology equipments have never been cheap because they're reliable and strong lasting. This watch has a battery life of 3 months without charging. This watch is made by strong plastic and rubber so that it will strong and light at the same. The price is $8,000 each watch, that's one expensive watch that can be worn by man. The price is closer to the Rolex watch, that's insane. Well, this watch is used in Algeria, Egypt and Libya only in Africa. Do you think North Africa is powerful than West Africa? Make sure you comment down below on this video. At number 2. We have the biggest military satellite that's used by South African National Defense Force. It's called the Berry Eye. It can detect and scan with a revelational super scope. In South Africa we have a 40 military satellite operating within Africa, to check the for any enemies trespassing the South African soil. This satellites have red lasers that can burn or cut any military aircrafts and nuclear bombs also burn infrastructure. The laser is made by diamonds, since 80% of the diamonds in the world come from South African mines, and are mostly owned by John Rupert who's the richest man in South Africa together with Nicky Oppenheimer. This lasers were mostly used to finish the Middle East countries. Well, the United States government made an agreement with South African government on military resources. Plus if America or Europe goes on war, South Africa will come and help them for some unknown reasons. Let me give a quick task soldier, click the right hand corner of your screen to subscribe to channel this will help you get more free information and technology about things happening in Africa. Moving on at number 1. We have the world's most powerful and dangerous weapon, that can kill the whole universe which is called the thermobaric bomb which is bigger than an African RDP house. This bomb is powerful enough to bomb two normal country size like Nigerian and Egypt. Currently South Africa has four of this aerosol vacuum bomb. This bomb weighs 7,100 kilograms. 
This bomb can fly for a speed of 16,000 km per hour, that's faster than a snake bite. This explosive was made in Russia and in year 2013 after Nelson Mandela passed away, South Africa decided to buy this atomic explosives. South Africa blowed a lot of money on buying satellites and nuclear bombs, that's why it doesn't have enough soldiers compared to Egypt. Do you think if Africa was united, we would be undisputed continent in the world? Make sure to comment down below. Well, those are all top 10 expensive latest military technology used in Africa. If your country was not named or mentioned here, it means that your country has to work hard in developing the economy to able to buy military technology weapons. Thanks for watching until the end. Make sure to subscribe if you like the video. And also please comment positive things, not outranged things.